This is a demo of the Mass Data Discovery Portal's Improved Download Basket feature. To begin, I will add observations to the download basket by clicking the Download Basket icon on the toolbar after selecting rows in the grid. This can also be done by opening the More menu in the Actions column in the grid and clicking the Download Basket icon to add a single observation's products at a time. When the download basket has files, you can also click on the My Download Basket button at the top to open the download basket. Like the older basket, the new download basket allows you to download data products associated with your selected observations, but with a new interface. I've selected observations from the Swift, HLA, and HST projects, and I will add them to the basket. I will now go over the new interface. Along the top of the window, you will find the reorganized toolbar. The toolbar allows you to remove products, view a count of available files, view an estimate of your download size, and retrieve selected files. On the left of the download basket, there is a simplified collection of filters. Selecting a checkbox will apply or remove a filter to your files. Choosing filters will also update the count of available files in the toolbar. It is important to note that by default, the basket is filtered to only show recommended products until this filter is changed. By unchecking the recommended products box, you can expose other products such as FLT or RAW files for HST and various products for other missions. In the center of the basket, you will see your added files organized in a tree structure going from missions to observations to files. As each folder is expanded, you can view the number of files available for each mission and observation. At the final level of the tree, you can see a brief summary of file information, including type, file size, whether batch retrieval is available, description, and project. As you highlight an observation folder or file, the right portion of the basket will show you any available details for the selected item. To select files to download, use the checkboxes listed along each mission, observation, or file. Selecting a folder will also select all files that are inside the folder. This will also update your download size estimate in the toolbar. For all mass missions available in the portal, the files are available online and may be retrieved via the browser. For example, to download the selected HLA and Swift files, Select the download button to open the download dialog. Available options include zip, tarballs, and curl scripts. When requesting a large volume of data, only the curl option will be available for you to execute later. An important distinction for products in the HST project is that the HST products may be acquired via batch delivery. Previously in the portal, you would be redirected to another page to initiate this process, but now you can request these data via one of the batch methods directly out of the interface. Clicking the Batch Retrieval button opens the Data Retrieval dialog with three delivery methods. The Staging option will alert you by email when the products have been staged to the archive servers with information on how to retrieve them. Selecting SFTP allows you to specify an SFTP server for MASS to send the data products directly. Selecting DVD allows you to input information for MASS to mail you one or more DVDs containing your requested data. This concludes our demo of the Improved Download Basket. For more of our demos, visit our YouTube channel, STSCI MASS.